hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing well and doing amazing so before we jump into the weekly vlog i have a product that i want to share with you guys who is also the sponsor for this video which is do or dry so as you guys know i have been changing my style that is nothing new to you guys you guys know that so i've been wearing a lot of really light colors and like just whites and off whites and creams and all of that and in doing that which i love i've noticed that i am sweating i mean i sweat i'm human right everybody sweats but with wearing those colors and investing in quality um material like linens and things i am getting sweat stains which sweat stains are not cute and they are hard to get out of clothes, right? So I'm having to take my clothes to the dry cleaners in order to get those out because I'm afraid that I won't know how to get it out at home. And I feel like you have about one try with a stain before to get it out. If you don't get it out that first time, it's never coming out. So I think I've always sweated, but because I was never wearing this many light colors, I never really noticed. It was never really an issue. So right around the time that I was again in the market to try maybe a different deodorant, this company contacted me and asked if I wanted to try their products. And once I read about it, I was like, uh, please and thanks. So I have been using it for a while. I wanted to use it to see how it worked and see how I liked it. And I also wanted to have my Hero products because they sent me quite a few products and I love to try things and find the Hero products, the products that I, like the products that I love and I feel like there are things that I will buy with my own money. There are things that I would just have forever, like things that I would go back and purchase. So they sent me the AM deodorant and antiperspirant. They also sent over the deep cleansing and deodorizing wash, um, PM antiperspirant, and then they sent over the body protection, the odor protection spray. So Do It Dry made these products for people who have excessive sweating. And if you're noticing that you're wearing certain types of clothes because you don't want your sweat stains showing, or you bring an extra shirt, and this is for women and men, you bring an extra shirt places because you're like, oh, I might have to change because my sweat stains, this is for you, okay? I definitely no I definitely didn't notice how much sweating I was personally doing until I started wearing, again, like light color clothes. And I was like, what is going on? <laughs> what is happening with my armpits so i was very excited about trying this this is a treatment of sorts so that's why it comes in like a lot of steps um you can also just buy one or two of the items which i would tell you which one i recommend to just do that with but if you're someone again who has like hyperhidrosis which is extreme sweating um i would recommend kind of doing the whole step routine and seeing how that works for you so your am routine is going to be applying your deodorant now you can always go in with your wash and then apply your deodorant um the deodorant sorry i've been using it so it's it looks a little dingy. I don't want to show you guys, but that's how it looks like. It's just a regular deodorant. You roll it up and you roll it down and don't apply too much. You just need like one swipe. Applying more is not going to make it work better. I'm the queen of applying more because I want it to work better. This though, I have really been enjoying. This is the deep cleansing deodorizing wash. This is what that looks like. It's like a little soap. You also need a very tiny amount of this, not a lot at all. It comes out like that and you just take some, you put it I put it in my hand and then I wash it. Um, and then I use the cloth that came with it to dry. But you can also leave this in your shower and use it every night before you go to bed. So uh, I think I'm gonna leave mine in my shower because I'm a night showering person. So I'm probably going to um, use it more if I leave it in the shower at night. This, this, this has become one of my favorite products. It gets your underarms so clean, so clean. Like I feel like my problem that I used to have is that I used to just have buildup of deodorant, even when I would uh, wash with my regular soap. I just used to have, I feel like there was still some clogging or stuff in, going on. I feel like using this, everything comes off. It is literally a cleanser, a deep cleanser for your armpit. So I highly recommend this one right here. And then we have the two other products. So now this is going to be your nighttime routine. This is the PM antiperspirant. This is what that looks like. It's gonna take a little bit out of this in your fingers and you're gonna apply it under your armpits and you're gonna to go to sleep. You're not going to use a deodorant at night. Take the wash and this little guy and you are good to go to bed. And then ugh, favorite product out of the whole bunch. This is my favorite product. This is the body protection spray unscented. This is what that looks like now. 
this is a product that I've been loving. Even if you don't have hyperhidrosis and you don't suffer from excessive sweating and all of that, I recommend for everyone to buy this and get this just because the way that I've been using this is a little different. I'm pretty sure this is not how the company um, intended for this to be used, but I spray this um, on my body. Like <laughs> I put this like, especially, okay. TMI, I have bigger boobs, right? So there's a lot of boob sweatage going on, okay? There's a lot of boob sweatage. And that's always been something that I was super self-conscious about and super annoyed by is that there would just be so much moisture going on in those areas. And I would be like, oh my God. So what I, what I do now is uh, before I, when I get ready, it's part of my get ready routine. I just take a little bit of this and I spray underneath the boob area and then like right in the cleavage area and it dries down completely. And I have noticed a huge, huge game changer, game changer for my big boob girls, game changer. You need this in your life. I absolutely love this stuff. That's what I've been using it for. It works amazingly well in that area. And I've just noticed that that area is just nice and fresh and just better <laughs> than what it was. Now you're supposed to use it over time to see complete dryness. I was, I've been using it for steady two weeks now and I've noticed there are no more, there are basically no more sweat stains on my clothes. So I would definitely say in that respect that it completely works. Um, it took about a week before I started seeing some changes. I was still kind of sweating like normal and I was wearing a lot of my white clothes during that time because I wanted to see if it would work or not. But yes, I would say that about two weeks um, I noticed that my armpits were staying dry the whole day. So yeah, thank you so much for Dura Dry for sending me over these products. Check the description box down below for the link to buy this product. Okay, so let's jump right into the weekly vlog. Good morning, guys. Today is Friday and I am about to head out of the house. I have some errands I wanna run today. I was gonna film a video, but I've worked a lot this week. I just wanted some time to myself. If I feel like filming when I come back, I would do so, but Right now, I just want to go and have me a cute Friday moment. Get some shopping, give me something to eat maybe. Just, you know, just do that and not work today. Maybe later on, but not right now. I don't feel like doing it right now. I slept in, which feels great. I listened to a book. I listened to some affirmation. I'm ready to get my day started. So let's go. So I'm back in the car. I am done at the mall. So I'm gonna show you guys a few things that I picked up because if I don't now, I probably won't later. So I stopped by Coach and I got this bracelet. I thought it was really cute. I was gonna get some shoes, but they didn't have my size. So I got this instead. It's like a little cuff bracelet. I thought this was just super duper cute and classy. So I got that. Put that back. I get. I stopped by Saks and Fifth or Off Fifth, like the Saks outlet, and I got these earrings, which I've been thinking about. I think they have some Gucci earrings that look like this, but I wanted to try kind of an off brand first and see how I felt about it. So they're just these beautiful earrings with, I think it's a some type of cat, lion, tiger, whatever head. And then the earring, I thought this would be super duper cute. So I got those. And then the most expensive purchase of today is these sunglasses. They are from Saint Laurent. And I love these. I like the how simple the thing is. So you just pop them open. And I was gonna get the black ones, but I went ahead and got these ones instead. These are the glasses. They're like that. Um, like a deep brown color and then they have the YSL on the side of them and I just think they're so cute they're so me they're so simple but so like freaking classy and I've really been enjoying wearing brown glasses because I feel like they work a lot better than black glasses in my opinion so I really love this it also came with a 
Saint Laurent dust, uh, like a duster thing. And yeah, so if you're looking for some designer sunglasses, I recommend going to Office. They have some good stuff there. So these are the glasses. I love the gold of the YSL there because I have a bag that has the same gold YSL. So excited about wearing these. Okay, I think I've got one more thing and it's not even anything big. It's just a hat from adidas it's just one of these flexible hats i like i've been wanting these so i got myself one and the thing is this mall is an outlet mall so everything that i got is very 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 affordable they were all on sale or they all have some type of discount on sale. so yeah i am heading home i think i've done enough damage for the day it is time to go home and chris just called me right now and he told me that he was already home he came home early from work so i'm gonna go hang out with my boo so i'll see you guys later good morning guys and happy new week today is monday and i am currently heading out to get my hair done um, i'm getting my hair braided today and i have a bad habit of almost always running late to my appointment but before i go i want to show you guys what i have on today i'm just it's a basic outfit but for the sake of sharing my clothes, let's go. Okay, so this is what I'm wearing today. I know you're technically not supposed to wear brown and black together, but I don't care. I am have on this, uh, I got this sort of like thin, it's not a blazer, this is, this is literally two pieces of cloth together. It is not thick at all. It's kind of like one of those, um, it's not a full, full sleeve, it's, I don't know. I don't know what to call this, okay? I have this and then I have my H&M just um, dress, the one that has no sleeve. I think I've worn this before. And then I have the hat that I bought at um, Adidas the other day. I think it was Friday. And then I'm going to just wear some sandals. And I have my rings, my watch, and my bracelet that I got from Coach the other day as well with you guys. And I am wearing um, the earrings that I got the other day as well. So that's just what I have on today. Um, I'm very much into, even if I'm not going out somewhere special, I still want to look um, cute and put together. And yeah, so I don't have to do a lot, just a little bit to look put together. So I have to leave because I want to really get some coffee. I don't know if I'm even going to be able to get some coffee, but I know I have to go stop by the bank to get some money um, to pay her for my hair. So let's go. Hey guys, so... I accidentally showed up to my hair appointment like really, really early. I thought it was at 10 a.m. It's actually at 11.30. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to go inside of Marshalls and Target and shop for a little bit. I think I have an hour or so. So I'm just going to do that until it's time to head back to my appointment. Hey, guys. Happy Tuesday. Yes, today is Tuesday. And it is our date night. So on Tuesdays. You guys have probably noticed it from the vlog. We have our standing date night. We have a restaurant we always go to that we love. And that's what we're doing today. So I am ready. And this hair looks really synthetic. <laughs> but you know what? She also had synthetic prices. Um, so yeah, Chris is getting ready right now. And I am just gonna open this box that I got from Target. So let's open it together. This is dry plant. Okay, so these are some dried um, leaves. I forgot what kind of leaves they are. Let me find out. Hey guys, okay, so it's late in the day and we have some errands to run. I need juices. And you know what I'm gonna do when I get there today? I'm going to ask them what time they close yes. because I was really upset yesterday. We got there 20 minutes before they close. Yeah, we got there 20 yeah. minutes before they close. Yeah. And the girl was just yeah. like, can you turn it down? Yeah, over there? The girl was like, we close at 7 and it clearly says they close at 8. So if it's her, they, if it's her there today, I'm sure she's going to lie. But I'm hoping it's somebody else that can tell me when they actually close. Um, but yeah, so we have to get some juices. We need to get some wings for dinner. And then, what else? We need to go to a world market. 
and possibly some coffee creamer from Sprouts. Maybe Home Goods. Mm. Yeah, I never thought I would say this, but I'm not in the mood for Home Goods wow. today. I'm shy. <laughs> I'm usually always in the mood for Home Goods, oh, but man, it's I don't really want. You want to go the other way? You skipping your class? <laughs> Skip, skip. You sad? I'm sad. No, you're not. I'm just giving up. I have to spend time with my big girl. Because you work too damn much. Alright, guys. So. Yeah, I kind of like. I don't really like marble anymore. Oh, really? But it has to be that L shape. So it can go underneath. Yeah, like that. But look at that wooden one next to it. Except I don't know if this. This truck. And you can slide it right under. Whiskey. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That looks good. Have you been shopping with me? Yeah. One of the rare times, but yeah. <laughs> Baby, I think I want oysters, like really bad. Go you wanna get a drink somewhere? Sure. No, thank you. Let's go grab a drink somewhere. That's a good oyster bar.